This is a tutorial on how to customize a template and use it for a TTV basic campaign. First, log in to your Microworkers account. To run a TTV campaign, we need a template. We start by clicking on My Templates tab. Here we have Custom Templates and Default Templates. Under Custom Templates, it says No Templates Found because we haven't customized the template yet. If you want to create a new template from scratch, click on Create a New Template button. But that will consume much of your time. To make things easier, Microworkers created different templates we can use. Our campaign is about data collection and available money transfers in different areas. We need a data collection template preferably a spreadsheet. To customize it, click on Clone first to create a duplicate of the template which we will modify. It will be saved under the customized template list. We will edit the template according to our liking. In this case, title should be Data Collection on Money Transfers in the Area. Scroll down to Task Instructions. Simply delete the default steps and enter our own step-by-step -step procedure that workers can follow easily. Keep them clear and concise to avoid confusion which will result to incorrect proof. Sometimes, when steps are complicated, workers also lose interest in the job. This will make our campaign slow. We don't want that. Now. If we want to put emphasis on a keyword or an important step, we can bold or italicize it. You can even add numbers or bullets. This is the data table where workers will enter their answers. To customize the field names or column names like website, direction, email and phone, click the source button. This is the back end of the template where we can add or remove elements or objects. Let's change the field names to what we need. Name, city, country, and money transfer available in the area. Hit Save and Preview to see what our edited spreadsheet looks like. Here are the new fields of the spreadsheet. We don't need this URL here. We want this part editable. How can we change it? Again, click on Source. Change Data Editor to Data Type and False to Text and then leave it blank. We now have four writable columns. Click on Update and Preview button. This template is ready to be used in a campaign. Let's create a basic campaign. There are different zones we can target in BASIC. If you click on International Zone and check the countries within it, these countries are excluded from the campaign. It means our campaign will not show in their jobs list. But if we choose other zones like USA Western, Europe West, Europe East, Asia and Africa or Latin America, and we check the countries within, it means that our campaign will appear in their jobs list. Now, let's select all countries in Europe West because this is where we will run the campaign. In BASIC, we can only target or select one zone per campaign because each zone has different cost assigned. Let's select the most suitable category so we can get the assigned cost for this. Since this is a data collection camp, let's go with text data collection. We can now select the template we customized. TTF is the amount of time given to workers to finish the task. Ours is so simple that it can be finished in 3 to 5 minutes. Number of positions is the number of workers we want to complete the task. Let's put 30, which is the minimum in BASIC, 
unlike in higher group where the minimum position is 1. Estimated cost is automatically computed based on the number of positions multiplied to cost assigned. So any changes in them will reflect instantly. Since we want our campaign to be finished quickly, let's set speed to 1000, which is the max speed. In case we want the positions to be filled slowly, we can lower the speed even while the campaign is active. Let's put a title that can be easily understood by the workers to attract their attention. In Job Requirements or Qualifications, we can remove the default sentences here or add our own requirement. Admin instructions are only for jobs that require admin review or rating. We don't write steps here or URL. Let's add something to job requirements. Make sure your answers are actively used in your area. We do not need a file proof because we already have a spreadsheet. Let's choose the first option. We will check the QD optional because we want everyone, those who failed and passed qualification tests, to see our campaign. If the steps are too complicated or require a special skill, then we can leave this one unchecked. Time to rate? 7 days. This means we can rate tasks within 7 days. If tasks remain unrated beyond 7 days, the system will automatically rate it OK, whether or not the proofs are correct. We don't want that, of course. Task Rating Option Admin rate means admin will rate all tasks based on the admin instructions we set in the template. However, admin can only perform simple requests and not performing checks of ratings or choices. Admin review plus rate means all tasks will be reviewed by them, then afterwards we will be able to rate them. Employer rate. This means that all tasks will no longer go through admin for review, but directly to us. Click create a campaign to go to the next page. You still have one more step in order for your campaign to be submitted. Please click the button at the bottom to continue. We do not need auto rate for this task. Auto rate requires test case file. Check on preview and confirmation, then confirm. Ta da! Campaign is now submitted and activated. Question! Where can I find the template I created? It can be found in my Templates tab under Customize Templates. For future campaigns, we can clone or edit it. We can also delete templates which we have no use for. We can also reuse the template as it is for another basic or higher group campaign. Another question. How or where can I see if my campaign is already running? Just click on my TTV Campaigns tab and there it is. Under the Progress column, you will see how many tasks have been submitted, which is for now, zero. Another way to check on our campaign is by clicking the Jobs tab. You can easily see your TTV campaign in the list because of the My Campaign yellow label. This ends our tutorial on how to customize a template and use it for a TTV basic campaign.